Well, flight lieutenant pinched an eight-length lead as they left the gate in this toad handicap chase. Green Green Desert is back in second position. Uh, Jazzy Refrain, obviously uh, going to be held up by Adrian Maguire as flight lieutenant goes to the first. Has a good look at it, but takes it about six clear. Flying it in second is Green Green Desert, reducing the deficit to five lengths already. There's a gap of six lengths then back to the mare, Jazzy Refrain, as flight lieutenant, the leader, goes to the first of the ditches. And once again, has a little bit of a look at it. Green Green Desert is, is uh, very fluent in second, closes to within two and a half lengths of the leader. And then this gap of six or seven back to Jazzy Refrain, just lobbing along, switched off by Adrian Maguire at the back of the field. Two fence number three then, down the back on the first circuit, and flight lieutenant just being ridden into his fences. Green Green Desert is jumping quite uh, beautifully in second, two lengths off the pace. Then a gap of five back to the mare, Jazzy Refrain. So that's the order then as they leave the back stretch behind them for the first time. And flight lieutenant giving Green Green Desert a lead at the moment. There's about two lengths between first and second as they turn for home for the first time. Then a gap of about five back to Adrian Maguire and a jazzy refrain as they head up to fence number four. Flight lieutenant and uh, Green Green Desert jumped almost alongside uh, flight lieutenant there. Is uh, pretty keen to get on with it and a uh, little to choose between the pair as they come to what will be the last fence next time. And Green Green Desert landed alongside uh, Flight Lieutenant, who's now been reined back by David Bridgewater. But uh, Green Green Desert doesn't want to be left in front here by Jemmy Osborne, keeping a very tight hold of his head as they come up past the post. But uh, having little alternative now but to let uh, Green Green Desert go on into the lead as they pass the post with a circuit to go. So uh, tactics sure to. Uh, play an important role here and Green Green Desert is going to jump this next fence about three lengths in front of Flight Lieutenant and then a similar gap back to uh, Jazzy Refrain. So it's all changed after the first three quarters of a mile as they turn down the side of the course and onto towards fence number seven here and Green Green Desert by about three lengths now to Flight Lieutenant and then a gap of four to uh, Jazzy Refrain. So into the wings of fence number seven and Green Green Desert's jumping beautifully in front by three to four lengths here over in second position flight lieutenant and then a gap of three to Jazzy Refrain Adrian Maguire yet to make a move on the mare and now to a ditch fence number eight and the lead is jumping beautifully in front Green Green Desert he's gained ground at most of the fences only his second start over the major obstacles remember after that novice chase uh, win at Taunton into a handicapped company today and he leads down the back Green Green Desert for Jamie Osborne by two lengths to Flight Lieutenant and then three to Jazzy Refrain. So on to uh, fence number nine, it'll be the first down the back and Green Green Desert but to just uh, the other two just closing up on the leader, Green Green Desert, another big bold uh, leap here, Jazzy Refrain jumped up very nicely there up on the outside of Flight Lieutenant, both second and third taking closer order on this leader and now to uh, a ditch, the middle one down the back. Green Green Desert uh, really stood off it and uh, gained about a half a length in the air over Flight Lieutenant who has a half length to spare over Jazzy Refrain who's just been uh, settled back into third position again after making that move down the back. Green Green Desert taken on by Flight Lieutenant up on the outside as they go towards the third last. There's not going to be much in it. Green Green Desert was the better jumper though from Flight Lieutenant who's gone with him though on the outside. Two and a half lengths then back to Jazzy Refrain and the Flight Lieutenant is showing ahead again. Uh, Flight Lieutenant and David Bridgewater has kicked about a length and a half in front of Green Green Desert and then a gap of three lengths back to Jazzy Refrain and one's got the feeling that there's still all to play for here at the top of the home stretch with two to jump. Flight Lieutenant comes down to the second last. Green Green Desert is challenging again over on the far side and back in front of Flight Lieutenant is down. Oh and has brought down Jazzy Refrain. Drama at the second last then. Green Green Desert, who just re regained the lead again, has been left out in front. And, uh, well, he's going to come home alone. That's uh, bad luck on the other two. But uh, Green Green Desert has uh, jumped spectacularly on his first uh, outing in Handicap Company. And it's just being eased by Jamie Osborne coming up to pass the post at the moment. The only finisher and the winner of the tote handicap chase in his own time.